Winds caused problems all over the metro as, as you said, trees fell onto power right. lines and as we've seen onto homes as well. Yes, yeah, so but Atlanta News First reporter Rebecca Schramm continues our first alert weather day team coverage in unincorporated DeKalb County. So Rebecca, you're seeing one home that got some major damage. Yeah, absolutely, Lana and Rick, good morning to you. You know, for a lot of people, you might be getting out and about this morning and you're seeing a few limbs down or some branches. Well, got to show you what this family is dealing with. Look at that. Now that we've got some daylight, you can really see the damage here. Uh, the, it looks like a tree uh, came down from the back corner of the house and fell right onto it, taking a whole chunk of the house off. This is an unincorporated North DeKalb County between Tucker and Shamley. The street is called Brook Cliff Way. Now I want to show you a map of all the weather related damage reported to DeKalb County authorities overnight. You can see the damage is widespread here in DeKalb County alone. Multiple trees down causing problems, but remarkably no one reported any injuries. Well, here's some video to give you another look from overnight at the home on Brook Cliff Way, which is not far from Briar Cliff Road. It, it looks like it crashed through what appears to be an upstairs bedroom because we can see a mattress and box springs there. Now, obviously the family had to leave. They cannot stay here. And, but as you know, DeKalb County did get hit pretty hard when those high winds moved through. We've got reports of damage all across the county. Here's one tree we saw that's now leaning dangerously. Look at this. It looks like the whole tree could fall onto the house at any minute. Of course, right now, the only damage is to the uh, gutter there on the corner, but they're keeping a close watch on that. And back here live, we want you to be careful as you're out and about this morning, because as we said, a lot of branches down, a lot of limbs on the street, and some of the smaller neighborhood roads they haven't gotten to yet, so they may not have been able to clear them off. So just be careful as you're driving through uh, your neighborhood this morning. We're live in DeKalb County, Rebecca Schramm, Atlanta News First.